play. Yeah. I'll play. Let's see what I'll play. That's what we're going to do. Woo! That's what we're going to do. This will be our final round of French Prop. And we, uh, we're going to have both teams play together. No points will be given. Uh, but we'll still be good. Oh, it's here. Oh, it's here. seen it anyway, so that's, that's good. We're doing all things. This show is called Salve Onions. Oh. Live reading of a stranger's diary. Has anyone here seen the Salve Onions? Cody! <laughs> <laughs> Would you like to be her judge? Sure. So, <laughs> uh, contestant should judge. He just does it all. <laughs> He's part of the show now. Oops. Okay. All right. Salve onions. Uh, who, who, have you all seen it? We've all seen it. We've all, all seen it. Okay. Oh. So that means something. We'll just see what they do. Yeah, we'll just yeah. have a fun it's time. It's a whole group thing. So Woo! It's not for points. Yeah, it's not for yeah. points. It's just for fun. Just doing this for fun. We don't do a strength now. Salve onions. Live readings of a stranger's diary by Wes Kester. <laughs> As a penance for two decades of nosiness, Kansas City comedian Wes Kester shares the real, unedited entries of their diaries and journals, from years of awkward adolescence to their current entries as recent as yesterday. Wes invites audiences to revel in their own mortification and maybe find familiarity in the open and honest and melodramatic thoughts and feelings of a total stranger. Bo Burnham is so sexy. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I would say if this was a dream. But really, this is real life. West, it's me, Bo. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm every Whoa. bit of feminist as you'd hope. <laughs> really? Oh, I was just journaling about you and now you're here. I'm here. Or am I in your dream? Whoa, I don't know what's real and what's not, but you know what? This feels good and I'm okay with that. So, should we do some comedy together? What do you say? Oh, no. <laughs> what? I came to tell you to quit. What? <laughs> <laughs> That's yes. right. You're not tall enough. <laughs> It's me, Phoebe Bridgers. You were talking to my boyfriend, Bill Burnham. What? This is a nightmare! I'm writing a song about you. Really? Oh, you're a homework. Well, maybe my fan fiction is actually you guys both fighting over me. Is that okay? I love that. Continue. Okay. West, age seven. Hey, everybody! I'm just sitting here because I was enjoying a uh, fresh onion at dinner with uh, <laughs> Ma and Dad. And um, Mom said that I need to take a bath tonight before I go to school tomorrow. And I don't want to do that at all. That shit sounds whack. I mean, that stuff sounds whack. <laughs> Dear Diary, I took the bath. It was fun. And I will do it every day for the rest of my life. August, July 22nd, 1.30 p.m. I'm 25 now, and I'm still taking baths. I was reading entries from many moons ago, and I figured out that I've grown a lot. Hey, Wes, great show last night. Oh, well, thanks. Bo? <laughs> I didn't think you'd recognize me after all these years. Of course I still recognize you. <laughs> Just with all the long hair and beard I grew during the filmed Inside on Netflix playing now. <laughs> he then took a cigarette from his tucked back 
ear placement. <laughs> <laughs> and he asked me if I wanted one. You want a bum one? I told him I shouldn't. <laughs> but I did anyways. So you uh, still writing that? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, here we go. All right. Jordy Lindenberg, everyone. Yeah. So, Wesk's show made me incredibly uncomfortable. This did not. <laughs> I think you did a really good job of uh, creating her voice, and uh, I give you extra points for actually mentioning onions, because they never mentioned them anywhere yeah. in the show. They're yeah. like, what are the onions about? When are we going to get to the onions? <laughs> I think the onions were the friends we made along the way. <laughs> 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 I'll give you all a million points. <laughs> that's all we have time for tonight, folks. And uh, so that's French Prof. We've done it. Good job. Thank you.